Hi everyone, I'm earlier today. My stream is scheduled for 12 Montreal time. And here already. Let me know if music is too loud or mic is too loud or all together so I can adjust it. And let's start to do something. Chat and send in some shameless self promotion. Yeah, hi everyone. Uh, this stream is supposed to be uh, bilingual, Russian English. Hello. Hello everyone. Yeah, so is it better if I will turn it down like that? That's all. Oh, I can hear echo. A good get it. Better now? Okay, well, uh, let, let me know. I will adjust. Ah, Joe! Hi! It's so good to see you here. So, um... Hold on. Yeah, that seems like a bit too loud. Even for me right now. Okay. Um... So, yeah, for those of you who followed my previous stream, I used to have, like, um, some long-term project I'm working on. And I used to have like speed, speed scout section. Um, this time I'm not prepared. So this is actually my speed scout from last a stream. A little bit polished um, after, but like basically the same thing. And I will continue to work on it and we'll see where it goes. Is it better? Okay, great, great. So it, this stream is supposed to be bilingual. I supposed to speak two languages, Russian, English. You can ask me questions in French, and I can answer it in English. That's pretty much it. Uh, Mike, oh, thank you, thank you for thanks for joining Saturday. People are supposed to be chilling, not like watching some production stuff. I'm sending something on chat. Um, so, yeah. Um, don't hesitate to ask me any questions. So, I wanted to say, even I think, like, then. I started this as a speed sculpt. I didn't have any particular stuff in mind. It turns out to be very art nouveau, so I will continue to do art nouveau since I like art nouveau. Um, we'll see where it goes, where it goes comes, and then. Demand cry. Привет! No. <laughs> <laughs> John Gann, who is American sculptor who was uh, studying in uh, in Krupska, yeah, I think Krupska, St. Petersburg, which is an amazing story. I mean, Russian academic uh, um, school is really strong. I think it's still strong, but I mean. Slowly died, dying out because it's like my 
my teachers was like, then I was studying was like in the 60s and 70s, so I don't know. I don't think they teach anymore. Yeah. <laughs> that group case is really cool place. I mean, there was like strong enough school in Moscow, right? And like at the time when I was studying, it was totally way too high that I can get um, the, the current skills I got. So I, my, my school was way more humble but they have a really great teachers like in paintings and drawings they were all heavy drunkards i don't know um does he give her no no uh um kill привет нет я думаю что просто камера повернута я сдам Клебалась и он настраивается. Как и есть. Нет, я правша. What the most difficult part to school in my experience? Oh, in the band. I mean, um, uh, for me, like for me, it's. I think it's very personal. For me, it's hard surface. I've been in the industry for ten plus years. My hard surface skills is very bad. Ah, very bad. Whatever. Uh, I know, but I I know um, the things that easy for me is faces and hair, and I know a lot of people who hate to do faces and hair. Um, so no, this is like it was. Um, I didn't. I usually don't work with the concept. Um, Oh, I draw them, I draft them for myself very quick because I'm basically uh, have to deep background and um, um, academic art training that we were discussing before. Um, actually, вопрос на твитке, работаю, мой портфолио, я только что бросила все ссылки в чат. Наверху проверить. И можно пройти через мой сайт, который, в принципе, прям на, на экране у вас. Uh, anybody's concept. I did it once, very recently. I did like I used friend of my concept. I never finished it. <laughs> I have to go back, but it's this is uh, like this is rare. I prefer to work on my own. I prefer to sketch straight in the brush, and if I stumble on some design problem, I go to Photoshop and I do overpaint. This is like how work. Ah, thank you, thank you. Bihar, hi, I'm, I'm, I'm glad to see you, hi. This is another very cool Indian artist. Uh, we just met uh, in person in the Summit 2018. And, yeah, he's one of the best uh, digital sculptors, a traditional sculptor. Uh, Кирилл, да, в принципе, ну, это, это вопрос предпочтения, правильно? А, я работаю над своими хапсорфейскилами, но так медленно, что ничего не будет таким. So, um, I'm gonna add some, um, some elements to that. Let's say um, more, even more stuff on here. Here, please like that. Um, 
I give it hi. I have it to see you here. Um, Ashley, I uh, have a regular streaming, unlike me here on Pixelogic. And she's doing great stuff. Oh, Bogdan, the my PRA. This is my first stream in 2019. I'm gonna have one in March. And it will be very short. This one is very short. I'm really sorry. I have something very important to work on. And um, I'm way behind the deadline right now. Red. Oh my god, you get some trouble. I'm, I'm it's gonna be so. <laughs> this is embarrassing. <laughs> uh, Vadim, hello. Uh, good to see you. Oh, thank you. Uh, come on. Uh, thank you, guys. It's very kind of you. Like, so kind. Thank you, Things Logic, for so kind. Um, not, I don't think I'm doing something special. Um, basically, I'm not sure what I'm doing at all. This is how my life is. We are both fish. Thank you. Well, it's kind of. I'm, I'm pretty surprised. Like, this chat is very active. <laughs> I will try to concentrate on my work. Because usually it's very quiet on Sunday. Thank you. So, you're super kind. We are all fish. Nickname. I want, I think, for sake of design, I want to pull this fabric. This is sort of fabric on here. Head piece. I want to pull it a little bit. Make it more fluffy. Mm. I'm not sure. I think maybe at some point I should make it asymmetrical. Maybe a bit later. I normally don't like to work in a symmetry, but this thing is supposed to be sort of art nouveau kind of thing and um, more decorative than like sculpture thing stuff. So I will probably leave it like that for now. And then you'll see I will break the symmetry at some point, but later. Just struggle with design. So I want this thing on her head, head uh, look a little bit puffy. Uh, 
Although it's not a hair, it's a it's sort of fabric, so like, unlike most of my girls, this time I decided not to screw the hair at all, so it will be like with a sort of, I don't know, weird headpiece. Why not? I've been sculpting like uh, multiple times on this channel, so something else. Sake of diversity. And like later when I will be rendering it. I want to render this um, uh, like uh, ornamental details in metal, so it will give nice contrast. I hope we'll see. Which thumbnail, Brandon? Thank you, thank you guys, that's very kind, very kind. What I want to do is um, oops, make this fabric like go out a little bit, stick out. Oh, bye bye, um, draw, yeah with artist life. Actually, I will finish the stream and go to back to work as well. So like I'm gonna be working. and was working yesterday and uh, stop to do the stream and I'm gonna work again. <laughs> I have something secret I can't show or tell at this very moment. But it's really cool. Thank you, Joe. Joe is the person who will be designing United States coins. <laughs> we hope to see Captain Marvel on the next uh, like 25 and oh, that's very cool, very cool. switch to lasso, like many instances lasso is more comfortable um, masking tool to work with.
Just to my nail. Hi. Uh, I'm not baby to anyone. No, for one person. But like, um, be very careful. I have both rights to moderate this chat on YouTube and Twitch. So any I can shit will be clean. Thank you. You people are kind. Sasha, привет! So this stream is supposed to be bilingual. I said it. No, I'm gonna say it again. So Russian English feel free to ask me questions. Hi Andrew, thank you. Very kind. Hi Pablo. Ah, oh, yes, um, I don't have any sketch. I usually work like from imagination. I try to sculpt straight in this brush. I think you can, I think this uh, I did as a speed sculpt uh, last stream. So you can go on YouTube and check like how it was started. And then I did some jokes, I did some polishing uh, after stream, after stream, but like, um, so yeah, like no concept, like nothing so i usually have some idea in my head before i start uh, hi Madrid Tajik. <laughs> uh, i i was thinking of something yeah maybe more eastern than western i, I don't know i like i uh, my main I think visual references was Art Nouveau. Mm, Art Nouveau is basically like mashed up of everything. Uh, so I don't know, I couldn't, I didn't say it's like particular culture. Uh, oh. Uh, hi the crown. Hi Kyle. 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 Uh, um. Actually, I know very two very good like speaking about Iran. I think this Faraz is a really good concept artist. He's from Tehran. I think he's now in Tehran. One of my favorite artists. He's really good. He was living in Canada for some time, but ne ne never managed to met in real life. But uh, very unfortunately. Thank you. Very 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 cool. What I wanted to do, what else?
pretty. I'm using a tab. I'm not sure what uh, uh, you mean by tab. Uh, okay. No, da. <laughs> Uh, лучше Витер Бак. Uh, ты, ты говоришь про Томаса, да? Он отличный, он вообще супер, супер. Uh, один из моих любимых людей в Баш комьюнити. Да, английский всегда хорошо. Всегда. А вот Джо, который сюда приходил, он выучил русский, чтобы учиться в России, поэтому... But I try, I'm still trying to make this look, look like public like. Control I guess. So this one. Да, понятно, да. Да, он отличный. Кроме того, я сама... У меня есть проект пытаться делать ювелирку, тоже на такой не драгоценных металлов. Поэтому э, я вот как раз э, с ним это обсуждала какое-то время назад. Э, да, да, будет еще, еще несколько человек будут стримить я на русском и на украинском, так что stay tuned. Justin, um, yeah, technically you can. I'm used to do some critics on um, on my Twitches, like in um, a, a, a part of Uh, uh, Twitch is not like I mind doing like teaching and like helping people um, just I'm super busy like I was working like I did my office hours and I do like hours after work and I was, was working yesterday only like stop waiting and basically sleeping <laughs> that's it um, and, and I, I have like current project which I'm very busy with so uh, you can try you don't get mad at me if I don't answer you immediately oh, and don't hesitate to poke me uh, like if I don't answer um, I'd rather probably do one stream devoted partially to feedback and critique again and just um, That's all need like some planning and announcement and I um, 
not this month, not this month. I even skip my January stream because I was too busy. Like, like it's impossible. Okay, what's going on here? So, for some reason, I was working on subdivides. What was the reason? Working on subdivides. Ah, I don't know. I think it's a good time to actually make this part into dynamesh. Um, make oh, I know actually I know why, but it's Always can roll it back and have it then subdivide. Мистерегл, привет! Dynamic, dynamic brush, hi! Получить опыт вне работы, создать, начать свой проект, как, как бы вообразить, что о чем мы сейчас говорим, о геймдеве или о чем-нибудь еще? Потому что, допустим, если я хочу геймдев, то ну, просто придумать себе некий проект. Допустим, я э, хочу сделать э, low-poly, э, hand-painted style, и начать его делать, и положить его в портфолио, сделать хорошо научиться положить в портфолио, положить пару. Я не думаю, что во всяком случае, но мой опыт он теперь уже никому не годится, потому что я начинала давно. Когда я заходила на, на, в эту профессию, было мало людей. Выходите немедленно. Паршат. Паршат. Хай. Хасан, хай. Sorry, people, if I butcher any names, I'm... 
Hello. Okay, thank you. <laughs> uh, because I always stress myself about spelling people's name. Народ веселится в чате. Да, кто эти люди? Спасибо, мистер Арго. Привет. Нет, этот стрим заявлен как Russian English. Ты на миссам question? Uh, yeah, I did miss question on uh, it's a Cinti, it's 27 inch Cinti. I haven't tried Huayon yet. Uh, 
and um, yeah, I, I can't say anything about it. I know people who work on fire and I'm happy about that. Um, just in one hour. Uh, well, if you ask me a question in English, I will answer you in English. It's a temporary measure because I'm used to do both English and Russian streams and right now I don't have a time. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> really, I take this autumn and winter was so bad like you can't imagine. Like I have to cancel um, January stream because I was not able to like to fit it in the schedule um and I, every time i like hoping like next month will be better next month will be better and, and it's not happening we'll see we might get better <laughs> let's hope fingers crossed right um uh, this, um, Roman, it просто это был спидпейн с прошлого стрима, который я решил немножко закончить. Не для чего, я для стримов обычно делаю просто скульпты, не для продакшена и даже не для печати. Я делаю очень много всего для продакшена в рабочее время, так что мне, в принципе, Do you prefer synthetic better for drawing part? Well, there... Uh, так, okay, so, like, this question in English, then I try to answer on, you know, in a border than the, how it came. Because I have two chats, like, um, in front of me it's Twitch and YouTube, so, Twitch, me, Chanto, um, oh, sorry, it was not a question, okay, um, Prashna, Prashna, I, I think, I, <laughs> uh, sorry, I hope I'm not butchering your name again, uh, no, I don't follow any concept, I have a grant in 2D, so I usually, and I try to work straight in the brush. I don't have any concept and I'm starting. So, yeah, it's purely the brush, no concept. Um, uh, concept that in the brush, if you want. Um, yeah, like I've been talking about it since the beginning of the stream. Uh, no concept. I try not to work with concept made by other people. Uh, like you can check out my art station and uh, I can actually, I will, I will drop a link because I think, but I only can drop link in uh, uh, Twitch or I can try to do it with stream, but I'm not sure if it's working, I'm pretty sure it's not. Yeah, everybody who is on Twitch, you can check my uh, social media, uh, blah, blah, blah. So, um, um, do you prefer Cintiq than drawing pad? I now work on Cintiq, like at my work I have two screen and doors and um, I actually I'm comfortable with both settings, like I choose Cintiq like for now, for home because I have some eye problem and it's better for me to watch like down than watch like straight on the screens helping my eyes helping me to work longer hours which I do right now a lot uh, so um, was it did I answer your question I hope I do uh, can I show polygraph yes uh, just give me one second uh, the, in fact there is um, uh, many uh, Subtools in this, so basically, I can walk through all of them. Um, 
Talking about polygraphs, I don't think there is nothing, anything special about them. It's all different subtools uh, for a uh, clear shape. I prefer to uh, at some point switch to um, subdivisions. So, like some parts of this sculpt is dynamic, some parts of it is uh, uh, subdivided. And you can see every time I need a clear shape, I try to work with uh, subdivision on the trim uh, um, This dynamesh is good for drafting, but with like for this particular purpose of doing like jewelry, kind of a clear look, it's better to have um, uh, different topology, clear topology. So let's say. Uh, pum, pum, pum. Uh, another questions. Uh, uh, question in Russian, um, which I'm gonna answer in Russian. Was it a good one? Georgi, this is a question for me. You ask me about the game, or I can и могу сказать так про геймдев, который в Канаде, к сожалению. Далее, очень скоро, совсем скоро. So, question about when the new Z-Rush will be out soon, guys. Just like, stay tuned, there will be like a lot of cool stuff. Finger crossed. Um, I don't, I, I never, like, a dark sky storm bringer, so can I <laughs> call you dark for short? So, uh, I never tried for you, like, I know people who work on we used to work on Wacom and then switch to Hayon and are perfectly happy because of, the, because of the price, right? Um, I just like I have money to buy Syntax, so I did it. I put, and I'm not sure if I will keep going with the Syntax or I switch back to Intos uh, for many reasons. Like Syntax is good for me now, but we'll see. I, I did it like never try for ya. Yeah. But basically, because Hoyon is still cost you money, right, to buy, and I decided not to take a risk, right? Because what if I wouldn't like it? It's a huge box, like all of this big. Uh, it's a huge, all of this big drawing screens is very huge. It's like once in a life purchase for me. Um, like I think, like if you don't have money, it's you know, no problem to get for you. And, and you know, people who are happy because I, I never, I never have a chance to like go sit and work in Hoyan and like make sure I like it. I like open worlds, um, etc., etc. Right? Because this is like free, like this is like your work process and it's so oh my god I don't know how to put it in words but it's so depending like I want it to be fast I want it to be, to be intuitive I don't want like, anything distract me from drawing that's why I bought myself like Cintiq Companion when it was out and compared to all my previous um, laptops on with drawing screen, the screen that can draw, with, with pen screens, it was much better. I don't have, I don't say it have no problem, like Wacom is like fucking full of problems, sorry, but this is the best that we get, we have in the market and that's why the price, the Hardware so like hardware so outrageously high. 
like I don't like them, but I don't see alternative, right? So this is this is for sure. For now, because I didn't try that. I didn't have a chance to go and actually try Hoayon. Not for because like if you go on a stand on an exhibition and try to do a few strokes, it like it tells you literally nothing because your work is your speed, is your efficiency, is like how fast you can get to like I don't know this and that eraser, like how good is the line is. So uh, like right now I'm trying to figure out if I need a new iPad and I I want to try it, but um, uh, I, I, I guess I have to try it for Procreate because I do 2D sometimes and um, yeah, I, I I still have a lot of doubts, I know a lot of people over it, I still have a lot of doubts, so yeah, I'm talking too much. <laughs> okay, uh, another question on um, the Russian chat. Yeah, 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 my country. This is exactly that. Like, oh, many people have like dry eye syndromes with like working the uh, computer screens. I have it quite severe a few years ago, so I decided I would rather get my eyes on rest and work working down. Um, uh, so um, Georgi, uh, я работаю в Ubisoft. Um, не часто задают вопрос, как попасть в Ubisoft. <laughs> Ответ очень сложно, если uh, Ubisoft Montreal не делает визы. Ubisoft Montreal не любит делать визы людям из стран третьего мира. Я начинала в Канаде не в Ubisoft. Я, меня наняли в Ubisoft, когда у меня был вид на жительство. Uh, поэтому um, я, конечно, могу сказать, заведите себе хорошее портфолио, пыры, но по факту им очень, это очень длительный процесс, как бы, делания визы. По поводу того, мне кажется, что вот портфолио достаточно хорошее, хорошее портфолио, и вас наймут. И очень глупые люди, human ресурсов, которые требуют какой-то мистический опыт, если у вас есть портфолио. Но большинство продакшн um, компаний для вашего же адвантаж. Um, на самом деле human ресурсы ничего не решают. Решает Команда, команда решает, она хочет вас нанять или нет. Если у вас хорошее портфолио, то Team Lead просто укажет на, на вас, и на ресурсе вас наймут, и все будет хорошо. Мне сложно судить о рынке в России. Я давно там не живу, я не знаю. Когда жила и работала в Mail.ru, ну как, ну... Я нанимала людей, но я не смотрела на опыт работы, смотрела на портфолио. Хорошо бы, конечно, иметь как бы, представление о том, что человек, да, там, там, иметь возможность спросить там, бывших коллег и так далее, да, что за работник. Ну, я не знаю. Уточни еще раз вопрос, стой прям конкретно, потому что я теряю нить разговора. Так, yes, a little bit difficult to switch between languages, but that's okay. I'm trying my best, right? Dark. Sky Storm. Um, yeah, it's kind of my opinion. Like, I'm not like I'm not saying that I am as bad. I just don't know, and I don't want to take a risk if I have like 
let's say eight, and if I can borrow it from someone for like a couple of days, plug it in and try it, I would tell if I if it's a good uh, a good uh, replacement for Wacom or not. But I would totally agree, Wacom is outrageously priced for what it is inside and how they actually care about their customers, etc. Uh, Circle Rush, hi! Hi, Scott Puppy, hi! Uh, Lushanka, Lushanka, Goosely, Goosely. Embarrass me like all great people today, like uh, Vadim. Now, <laughs> hi, I'm so glad to see you. Thank you. I know I love you, I, I love your work. So. Okay. so I wanted to add this. Let's get back to actually the purpose of the stream. Uh, I'm going to add um, this element to the properties. Russian people make very funny chat there. I need Valen here. It's always slash we have here in Quebec. It's like I I really think like Valen here would work best. Like I think we need someone who like reinvent Valenki for like modern life, modern fashion. Ooh, ay ay ay. So I just wanted to get rid of this thin part on top. Да, у меня не есть идея насчет ювелирки. Я обсуждала с Томасом, но я до сих пор не знаю, это будет... Э, я, наверное, не готова делать э, э, из, из металла, но я хочу попробовать 
3D принтере для... Но это тоже ювелирка. И я могу показать... Но... Ювелирка, которая мне нравится, вот то, что она мне сейчас, но вы, наверное, не увидите, это польские ребята, они называются Macabre Gadgets, и у них такие интересные вещи с черепами и так далее. Я хочу делать что-нибудь в этом духе, но, скорее всего, все-таки не лить из металла, лить из все-таки пластика, скорее всего. Посмотрим. У меня есть проект, я не могу его показать там по очевидным причинам, потому что он не готов. Я хочу, если я дойду до стадии печати, я хочу, чтобы это было как-то серьезно. Я что показываю. У меня сейчас есть как минимум несколько готовых, почти готовых моделей, которые вот надо бы уже попробовать что-нибудь с ними сделать. Okay. Sure. Save. Talking too much. Save every 15 minutes. Uh, because 
Otherwise, it could be really sad. Okay. So I just want to add some elements to this part, and um, I have I don't have some drop parts. Um, some drop. Maybe something like that. Um, yeah. Question, question, question. Um, um, Johnny, привет. Hi. Uh, um, let me catch up with the chat. Uh, so, um, Sergo, I'm not sure. And um, я еще подняла вопрос. Технические смыслы. Ну чего, я уже печатала, но я печатала um, um, Collectibles, не могу показать. Um, -да -да. Uh, нач... Поскольку я никогда, ну то есть у меня нет законченного проекта по ювелирке, я не знаю, может быть, может быть нет. Uh, uh, вот сделаю что-нибудь и тогда смогу сказать, мне кажется, что... Пока мое представление запрашивает достаточно. Но опять же, я не, не, не планирую пока, по крайней мере, делать ничего из э, драгметаллов, кроме креплений. Эм, стало быть. Э, смотри, если ты хочешь вообще про. На самом деле, мне очень интересно про ювелирку, поэтому я не знаю, мне можно всегда, мне можно всегда написать на Facebook. И мы можем пообщаться. Мне, мне, в принципе, это интересно, но, опять же, времени нет. Окей, next. Yeah, heavily inspired by art deco. I like art deco. Art nouveau. Art nouveau. Art deco is more squarish kind of style. And like, even I tend to mess them up. And friend of mine is like always like punching me. This is art nouveau. This is art nouveau. Okay. This is art nouveau. Art nouveau. Like then every time you see like muha line, like very, uh, like flow of lines, very smooth shapes. Um, this is art nouveau. Every time you see like uh, more squarish, more straight lines, it says art deco. Anyway, next. Um, uh, face like from maybe I didn't have like it was a speed sculpt from the previous uh, stream. So I then I do uh, speed sculpts, especially in the stream. I don't really think a lot of what face feature I want. Uh, yeah, maybe I like a lot. What is not a bad movie? Um, okay, okay, okay. Uh, um, Um. 
Окей, спасибо, да. Спасибо. Заброшенный звонок. Как-то не надо вернуться. Поэтому. Хорошо, я могу пулать фаза from her place for some reason. So, maybe I like the resilience. Things from this, uh, this element. Well, I want to have it more stripes of okay, nice. Uh, let's see this one. I think it can have more thickness. Those things. Um, I actually want to copy them. Um, I like that probably. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Ah, okay. That's I did the after groups and uh, I got this thing and this thing. Um, different poly groups. So, um, and I need them the same if I want to copy them. Interesting. Oh, yeah, yeah. No. Like that. But it's basically what I want that. Um Okay. Um, what is the oh, I'm a lot so what? Hi Matthew. Good to have you here. Uh <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> uh ну, мне тем самым, что а, зависит ехать из России куда. Я часто спрашивают, а, но это будет довольно специфический kind of, путь, в котором а, вряд ли Uh, Во-первых, вряд ли получится повторить. Во-вторых, um, дело в том, что ну, как бы вообще IT-индустрия очень молодая, и когда uh, по сути uh, какое-то время назад действительно специалистов не хватало везде, и их очень активно харили это всюду. Uh, сейчас сильно зависит от специализации. Например, техника артист 
их мало, их и программеров, и их не, не достает, и их действительно ищут, грубо говоря, их нанимают отовсюду. Много позиций, которые касаются арта, например, местные канадские школы, они научились выпускать людей, которые готовы к индустрии вот в этом в этих специализациях. И на самом деле даже здесь, особенно 2 d и характер артистам трудно найти работу. И, кстати, я не характер артист по моей основной работе. В основной работе я вообще пришла в Ubisoft текстурить инварменты. Кстати, текстурщиков инварментов на самом деле очень мало их. Вот. Ищут. Но я начинала в Канаде не в Ubisoft, начинала в другой компании. И, в общем, ту визу, которую я получала сейчас, по-моему, на нее нужно чуть ли не там, не получила без подтверждения языка. Сейчас, по-моему, мне надо подтверждать язык. Я не знаю, сколько я его не искала работу в Канаде, не приезжала недавно. Очень быстро меняется. Даже пока я здесь была изменился уровень языка, который нужен для того, чтобы подать на вид на жительство. Поэтому, не знаю, да, в России тяжело развиваться в теме визуализации, но надо сказать, что вообще-то русских художников очень много, и 3 d очень много, и они довольно крутые. Тут, тут как бы надо просто хорошенько искать, особенно сейчас. Короче говоря, мне кажется, ну это мое такое впечатление, скорее, что проще искать работу в русских отделениях типа Ubisoft. У Ubisoft есть украинское отделение, нет, Россия отделение. И пытаться переводиться, это один путь, это попроще путь. Или искать работу в отделениях, например, я могу говорить про Ubisoft, да, в отделениях, которые не находятся не в крупных странах, куда все хотят, а какие-нибудь Филиппины. Вот Ubisoft есть в отделении Филиппины, куда они, естественно, им тяжело нанимать людей, потому что не все хотят ехать на Филиппины. Ну, можно там поработать и проситься перевестись. Думаю, что да, будет лучший совет, который я могу дать. За время начинать не да. Да, в России я делаю мало впечатлений. И... Все задушили. Нафиг. Или все само передал. В России нет Ubisoft, Украина. Есть украинский Ubisoft. Ну, Кирилл, в принципе, да, ты прав. Для этого... И даже так, потому что... Ну... Сейчас легко работать. Их, им легко нанимать удаленкам, легко нанимать принцип. А с Пиросов работал с Ubisoft. Я знаю много людей, которые в итоге переехали в Ubisoft. Но я не знаю, работает ли он сейчас. Вообще без понятия.
There's a lot of chat in English. Like that is in Russian. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, this is bilingual stream. They like I can I have to say it again and again and again. So don't hesitate to ask me. Question in English, and questions in Russian, and then one soon. And I try not to go into one run because uh, <laughs> I can do. Okay, um, let's add even more elements like that. I kind of like it. Um, I think I want to make it one. Um, I'm polygroup so I can work infinitely. So, look at that now. I want to make this element sound so Weird. I feel like I'm, at some point I'm lost to symmetry on that element and uh, it's a long symmetry girl. Nice. So what probably do is let's go into solo. Let's just delete this. Look at it. Uh, let's go out of the symmetry, delete this thing. Um, Very well, I don't see because information, the mirror, and then very well. Ah, uh, perfect, hidden, oh, okay, right. Okay, yes. Ah, good, very all good now. Save, save is important, save every 15 minutes. Trying to polygroup control click on object doesn't mask the object. Gamer. Um, control click. Well, it doesn't actually. Control click. Control. No, control actually to polygroup. Um, Polygroup element, like let's say um, um, we basically have to mask it first and then do Ctrl V and then you will have like oh, oh that's right, huh? That's not, I'm not in symmetry, Ctrl V, so you have a new polygroup now. Uh, I think you like, and then if you want to select particular, you do control click, control shift click will select the polygroup. Okay, so right now we have this polygroup on two elements, so it's uh, isolating it. How about masking, masking, masking? No, I don't think masking. Um, then you have then you in transpose to yes, but you have you will select oh interesting so basically it will select uh, the element you're clicking on it will be unmasked so yeah right. I broke the um, polygon while showing the stuff. So again, to polygroup, I don't think that working uh, control click. I think it's working uh, it like uh, control to shift selecting uh, to 
polygroup in your masking and then you do uh, control V. That's how you create a new polygroup. You can also do after groups. After groups is uh, it's on my customized menu, but uh, well, it's blah blah blah. Um, polygroups um, here after groups. Do I make any sense? Transpose on the gizmo. Aesthetical, thank you. The transpose on. Like, I'm pretty sure there is probably some stuff, I don't know, actually transpose is a very powerful tool and I think I use it like maybe like 10% of it. Anyway, let's, uh, it might be, I might not know. It's as simple as it is. I wanted to add some jewelry on her neck and actually I want to do more um, on the bottom, so I want to do my body with later. Let's do that now. Let's do some fun stuff. Maybe. So just type lower the resolution of that one. Forgive me, clear shade. So it all. Maybe, not a bit. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I will try that. Like, I usually do control V to polygroup if I need a polygroup. Something selected, selected, and it's kind of, I don't know, it's what I use. Uh, the, I'm not saying it's most efficient thing, uh, that's what I'm in use to do. So, Zipers was like, <laughs> i getting lost all the time right now. Mm. They're gonna get even more, then you're gonna, gonna add up even more stuff. So, this is scary. Well, let's see. Okay, um, let's say I like it. And then, then. Uh, let's split everything. Because
I still sketch in a good stage, so I don't really need super sharp shapes, super accurate work. <sighs> so, uh, blah, 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 blah. Um, yeah, so yeah, um, рабочая атмосфера очень отличается от Ubisoft, и вообще отличается рабочая атмосфера э, западных компаний, компаний российских, и в лучшую сторону, но, к сожалению, потому что, я не знаю, я не думаю, что Россия очень быстро что там что-то изменится. Сейчас я вам расскажу историю. Я помню, я, у нас был open space в Mail.ru, и э, прибежал какой-то начальник и начал отчитывать своего подчиненного мата на весь open space 30 минут. Чувак опоздал, и тот на него прям, короче, прямо, я не знаю, там драма-драма. Все ему высказал начальник, обозвал всеми матерными словами, которые он знал. И это типа норма была тогда. Я не знаю, как сейчас, но что-то мне кажется, что вряд ли что-нибудь изменилось. Эм, такое себе представить в Ubisoft просто невозможно. Эм, эм, ну, то есть, эм, самое страшное, что бы могло случиться, не, ну, конечно, они могут уволить, если ты там нарушаешь рабочую трудовую дисциплину так сказать, но сначала с тобой очень вежливо говорят, очень вежливо, и сделают это, отведут, отведут тебя в переговорку и скажут, знаешь, у нас, мне кажется, что у нас есть такие небольшие проблемы, и в этом вся разница, поэтому, да, Та-та-та. Do you prefer dynamic meshes or mesh? I use both. It depends on what I'm working currently. Um, you see, like I have a lot of jewelry here, and like jewelry is like it looks good because it has a clear shapes. And to have is like clear shapes and lines. It's good to have. Ooh, um, good to use. Like a uh, nice topology will give you like nice clear shapes. Like this this element I'm working on now. If it would be dynamic, and I want to move it, it would go all wobbly. And now I have this like fine, beautiful. Uh, and that's, it's not perfectly fine, right? But eventually it will be dynamic, and that remesh, and dynamic, and do go through uh, like cycle of uh, dynamic and dynamic most of the time. And then it depends. Like general advice will be. Um, smooth like elements like jewelry and non-organic stuff try to make uh, try to work on a clear topology if possible there is times when you have to go to, to dynamic and dynamic is great for sketching but it is actually the uh, Let's not forget there is a um, sculptor's mod, and sculptor's mod is great for sketching, dynamic is great for sketching too. But uh, then you need a clear line and shapes. It's better to work with glorious and the better topology, etc. Anyway, um, I'm good here. I want to uh, go to geometry here and where else to see. Oh, okay. oh nice. That's pretty nice. Uh, like it. Let's say. Yes. Um, okay. Okay, let's go. Um, I have an idea, but I can't tell you. This is the thing. 
so like soon um blah, blah, blah. no i don't uh, have reference sketch uh uh think logical um i usually sketch in the brush but i have very specific background i came in from 2d um so it's easy for me I have to deep the ground. Um, I think for this particular work, you can go back to my previous stream, and I think it was uh, for like previous stream speed scoop sort of. Like, I, I, I'm not saying it's the most efficient thing to work with, it's just like I like to do sketch ideas in the brush. Um, I think. Probably the most efficient way of doing things is to do like rough with this sketch, to this sketch before. But I'm lazy. It's all explains everything. And I do sometimes I do have very rough sketches for uh, But you don't want to see them. They are super ugly. <laughs> it's like ugly is hell. Let's save. Um, another thing that um, I want to do is um, okay. Let's say I would uh, probably they would work with um, Ben initially. Uh, I want to add uh, one element. This one. Let's bring it on the top for now. Because the element I want to do is like that. And let's do uh, click code, maybe. Revolution. So, um, here we go. The, the dynamic coming handy. Uh, to the bench. And then, yeah, this is much better. So, you can you could see, like previously, it was very low poly, and now it's kind of have more resolution. Right? And then um, you may even go higher and do my damage again. And from this stage, we can actually set the mesh. And we'll see if I can get pinch. And make this uh, edges even sharper. Oh, yeah. Okay. And then mm. I don't like that. Uh, it doesn't look good. Георгий, если Ubisoft странные вещи, конечно, есть. Любой, любой продакшн, любой, любой коллектив иногда принимает странные решения. Ну, как бы, 
никто не застрахован. Я знаю проект, в котором в 2019 году люди рисуют нормал руками и гордятся этим. И тут мне нечего добавить. Мне как пожелать им всяческую удачу. Вот. В бесконечном количестве идиотских решений принимается в любой компании. Но это факты. Да. Сколько не сомневаюсь, что я тоже в своей жизни принимала кучу идиотских решений. Поэтому тут как бы сложно кого-то осуждать. Опа, интересный. I'm wondering what I should do now with this just I'm so basically I want to do it this element it's like necklace now oh, what we Oh, I am. This is bad. So, okay. That's what what happened is I made uh, made it symmetrical, but I forgot to press X. I need it to be symmetric. Yeah. Now it's in symmetry. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. This is very weird. Looks like I have a masking, but I don't have any masking. Why? Gosh, that's why. Huh? I see I'm doing idiotic things all the time, so I can't blame people for doing stupid things. Um, uh, this music is um, the channel that uh, the brush leaf recommended me, and I have no idea what's playing because I'm not in my headphones. I know it's some chill, chill station that uh, have no uh, license conflict. I should, I suppose, to answer in Russian. Sorry. Um, so about music. Um, sorry, Serega. <laughs> um, вот, кан... вот то, что сейчас играет этот канал, который мне Зубраш посоветовал, и который мы можем использовать один из немногих. Иначе начинаются проблемы с YouTube из-за музыкальной лицензии. И, эм... в общем-то, практически вот так. Мы ограничены выбором. Это какой-то специальный канал, который музыку транслирует для... для... Типа Twitch и YouTube. Royalty free. Окей. 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 And, um, Let's say I don't want to do the animations now. Okay. 
and basically do the same thing. Uh, click there. Yeah, okay. My, basically, I was working. Well, this model is in the symmetry right now, right? So when I add element on the, I don't know, it was like left side, right side, right? And then uh, if I want this element, like to have this element that I did on one side in the symmetry, I just go into geometry uh, here, like mirror and belt. And I have like mirrored uh -huh, okay. no, no, да, тяжело переключаться. Oh, let's say it's okay, I guess. Um, if I will figure out a better design, I'll come back. One thing I want to uh, change here is that I think oh, I can put this necklace closer to each neck actually. Mm, yeah, maybe. Maybe not a good idea, anyway, yeah. I want to add a little bit of the bust itself, so um, that too. And then, for this bit. Like, uh, this is question about the symmetry and how uh, things logical look like when each time I add the element, it's in the, by default in the center of the scene and it's in the symmetry already. So when I will move it down in this case and start to push in it. Oh, no. <laughs> okay, it's not with uh, Gizmo, right? With uh, Moto, it will be both to symmetrical, right? Time is it? Oh, actually, I've been two hours already. I will be finishing like in 20 minutes because I have something to do today. Um, um, question about yourself. Huh? Um, Georgi. Честно, я не пробовала, но у них есть очень большой пол лицензий. Например, я работаю в Топаган, я люблю Топаган. И когда ну, стоит по дефолту, его никому не ставят. Но я просто попросила, и мне его дали. И э, э, софт, который люди пользуют, не всем, но там, допустим, может быть, десяток, два десятка человек у них есть. 
И уж точно у них есть моды, уж точно у них там есть какой-нибудь, я не знаю, что. Много чего. Ну, а ее можно попросить. Хотя мы в компании, которая работает на Максе, в основном. А, я знаю, что очень многие люди ставят себе Майя. Опять же. So I want to make her some kind of dress. Like, it will be bust, so no, nothing... Nothing serious, but probably let's find that for now because it's on my way. It's really annoying. So let's um, even those. Uh, this. So what I want to do, I want to give you like that kind of neckline. Is that <sighs> chat? Uh, Серега, спасибо. Uh, uh, вопрос. Не знаю. Ну, наверное, кто-нибудь знает. Я не знаю, я не, не пользуюсь. А, а, ну, люди что так и не используют. Вопрос о том, как он софте, ну, да, но дело в том, что, например, Монреаль вообще очень много работает в Максе. И Висот работает в Максе, потому что Макс у нас проинтегрирован в движок. Поэтому, если кто, люди используют Майи, то они используют как бы как, как бы отдельно, а потом идут в Макс все равно. Из-за этого, кстати, я так не, 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 не научился работать в мае. Я до сих пор сижу в Максе, поэтому мне нужны всякие костылики, поганы, чтобы ретопологию делать. Очень много используют Макс. Вообще мы используем сейчас 14-ю версию на моем проекте до сих пор. Чат из хера, я. So I have like three uh, chats in front of me that we stream bring bringing together. It's like Facebook, YouTube, and um, Twitch, obviously. But like I only can post on Twitch, like so I, by sending the links. It's um, Okay, so let's stop writing. I only have 20 minutes. I want to do your uh, sleeves for this dress. Uh, let's... Here we go again. This is a uh, tiny match. I can do it in sculptures. But let's say tiny match. For now, and then we'll see. And then, um, so I want to do that. Okay, not that. Let's happen. And now, what we do here is the uh, gris, gris, 
из Panther. Um, но с Blender, кстати, Blender не бесплатный для компании, поэтому um, как бы, я, я хочу, я хочу посмотреть, но, uh, когда будет время. Никогда. Ха -ха -ха. Когда-нибудь, когда-нибудь время. Мне все будет хорошо. И блендер посмотрим, и все остальное. У! Асан! Я не знаю, что я там онлайн не могу. Я? О! Окей, okay, I don't know if you can hear me, people. Um, 